Guys, guys, I'm in the forest right now and everything looks the same. Look at the trees, the leaves and the cloud in my head. Why are they so similar? Okay, it sounds ridiculous, but look around. Everything in the nature is utter repeated patterns and we actually have a name for that, which is fractal dimensions. In 1982, Mandelbrot Brot first introduced the concept of fractal dimensions when he found that the planes of natural objects are too complex to be described by Euclid. Fractal dimensions mainly show that complex things you think does not follow any rules actually have one, which is a whole set of similar or identical patterns being repeated. Just like the microbots in Big Hero 6, with many tiny microbots attached to each other, it can make a hand, an FN tower, or everything. So it actually turns out that things that seem not to make sense really have their own sense. Let's jump right into an exercise. Look at this snowflake. How can you identify the repeated patterns? If you put a pox and zoom the surrounding area, it's a triangle. And it turns out that this snowflake is generated from triangle by duplicating more and more triangles on each side. This is known as the box counting method, which is why it you for even more complex shapes. By using fractals, both grandmas were able to create cramps that could copy fractals to generate structures in the game without us self-creating it. Also, by using fractal formulas from past hurricane formation, people were able to know when an upcoming hurricane appeared just by the wind speed. So, it's also just about recognizing the pattern and then ace it. Today, we have gone through fractal dimensions and have a different class of natural objects. So, you will no longer be the crazy guy running in the forest anymore. I'm Kyle, be curious, be fractal.